So you want to play GTA 5, but your PC is a potato don't worry there is a Chinese version that run way better and has a recommended system requirements of Intel HD 4000, yes that game is sleeping dogs, all jokes aside it's a very fun game and interesting game, and not just a GTA clone, but I'm sure you know all that, what you don't know is how you can make this game run even better, in this video I will show you how. Before we start please remember to leave a like, if you guys are pleased with your results, it helps me out a lot, and please consider pressing the subscribe button with the bell notification, you will find all the links mentioned in this video in the description down below. First of all it's incredibly important to ensure that you are running on the latest graphics card drivers from your graphics card manufacturer, to do so navigate inside the description down below to either the NVIDIA Jeffers or AMD Radeon graphics driver link, simply go to the automatic driver update utility found here, then select download, once the tool finished downloading open it up, and it will detect and install the latest driver for AMD Radeon graphics cards, it's a very similar process, simply go to the automatic driver, this will detect and install the latest graphics card drivers for your system, it's also the same process for Intel HD graphics. Now that we got all the boring updating steps out of the way we can now go ahead and jump in with the optimizations, first download the config file that you will find in the description down below, extract the file using WinRer 7 zip, go to sleeping dogs config folder and open the file named sleeping dogs commands. Now copy all of its content. Then go to Sleeping Dogs installation directory and create a shortcut of the game.exe file. Now right click on the shortcut on the desktop and choose properties, put a space at the end of the target, then press Ctrl plus B to paste the commands. Now go back to the Sleeping Dogs config folder, copy the file name display.xml. Go to the game directory then the folder data and paste it here, make sure to set it to read only so the game don't change it or remove it. And here are some extra tips to make this game run even better. If your PC is overheating try undervolting it. To do this download throttlestop. Extract it wherever you want. Go inside the folder and open throttlestop.exe. You can choose different presets, but the performance mode is the best. Now let's start undervolting. Click on FIVR. Then unlock adjustable voltage and lower the offset voltage by 50. If your PC run fine try lowering it further. If your PC crash try lowering it less. You will notice that your PC run way cooler. Before you start gaming make sure to set your power plan to ultimate performance if you don't have this option. Here is how you can get it. Go inside the optimizations folder then open the ultimate performance command file. And then copy these command. Now go to bottom left hand. Click on the Windows key and type in CMD make sure that you run this as an administrator. Once you guys are inside the command prompt go ahead and press Ctrl plus V on your keyboard to paste the command here and then press enter. We can then navigate back into the power options you'll then be seeing the newly created ultimate performance power plan. Simply select it and you are good to go. Next we will be doing some optimization that are going to be a lot easier to apply. Open the optimizations folder. Then now we're going to be looking for the reg optimization fixes folder you will find a bunch of registry files and we're going to be applying them one by one. To revert any of these optimizations back just open and if you want default reg files go inside of here. You can simply click on these keys one at a time and they will reset the default values inside of your registry. Launch your game now and you will have a smooth gaming experience. If you have any game request or you're having any trouble you can put it in the comment down below. And don't forget to like and subscribe for more. Thanks for watching.